Okay, so I've left the three boys at home. I'm headed to the airport because I am going to Mexico for a week. <laughs> so I'm leaving the kids with Drew and the Lola and of course the helpers, the angels we have at home. No, I'm super lucky that I get to leave. I'm heading to Mexico for the Jumanji press junket. It's going to be good me time for me, but of course, <laughs> I'm gonna be alone. I'm gonna be without the kids and my husband. Aww. One of my biggest concern is my breast milk because I'm still breastfeeding Leon. So I'm going to have to express milk while I'm on the go. And I'm going to try store my milk and bring it back here to the Philippines. So this is gonna be the longest flight where I'll be doing this. Normally, pag Hong Kong or Japan or Singapore, Easy. Even Australia, I was able to bring back my milk successfully. But ito, medyo 19 hours. Medyo mahaba yung flight, guys. So, sana hindi matunaw ang aking milk at uh, mauwi ko siya successfully. Yeah. Thanks to all the mamas who have been reaching out, who've been trying to help me. Thank you. Let's see if the way that I've chosen to uh, keep my milk will work. So, I'll let you guys know. Okay, wish me luck. para sa Jumanji Press Junket. Pero siyempre, dahil nagpapadede pa rin ako, um, kailangan ko pa rin mag-express ng milk kahit na nandito ako para hindi tayo mawala ng, ng uh, gatas, ng breast milk. Kaya, siyempre, dala kong mga gamit ko para mag-express ng milk. Papakita ko rin siyempre sa inyo mga Mars kung uh, ano mga gamit na dala ko para maghugas ng mga gamit ko. Ito talaga yung mga hindi pwedeng makalimutan ko. Okay, so ito na po siya. Dalawa siya. At uh, mag-express na ako. Ay, 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 ay! Okay, so tapos na ako mag-pump, mga Mars. Ipapakita ko to dahil gusto ko lang malaman ninyo na normal na hindi pantay mag-produce ng milk ang ating mga day-day. Ito ang ginawa ng aking left. Lagpas lang ng konti, so one ounce. At ito ang ginawa ng aking right. <laughs> so, kung uh, nagtataka kayo kung bakit mas marami yung isang side, mas malaki, um, may mga ganun talaga. Lalo na kung mas marami kang milk ducks sa isang day-day. In my case, it's my right side. So, um, ang sabi nila, mag-pump ka lang more often or magpadede ka lang more. But, hindi talaga. Kahit gaano, kahit gaano karaming beses ko ipadede si Leon sa kaliwang side, hoping na it would produce more, hindi talaga nangyari. It's normal, guys. Huwag kayo mag-panic. Ganon talaga. You just have to make do with whatever milk your boobs can produce. One ounce man yan or three ounces. It's time to store this and wash. Time to wash. 
Okay, so what I do is um, when I have to pump here um, abroad, uh, what I do is, syempre yung milk, hindi ko pwedeng i-store lahat sa ref na nandito lang sa loob ng kwarto dahil maliit lang yung ref, isa. Pangalawa, it's really not that cold. So um, what I do is, when I've collected maybe a few bags through the day, uh, I call the receptionist or the lobby uh, and I have someone pick it up so that uh, they can put the milk bags in their freezer. Okay, and now I shall show you the necessities um, for when I'm pumping and cleaning on the go. So this is something that a must have. This thing, I actually got this tip from another mom. Um, although nakalimutan ko na kung sino kaya, I, now I can't give her credit, but to the mom who gave me this tip, thank you so much. Um, so it's got really good suction. Let me just take it, and then you just unhook it like that. Tapos ito, natatanggal siya. So, um, you just screw it on. Uh, of course, meron din tayong bottle cleaner. Um, which I don't really use because I prefer using this. Feeling ko lang kasi mas okay yung pag yung linis nito. And I love this because mabilis lang siya mag dry. Of course, my bottle wash. That's actually it. That's all I need. But, 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 but. Here's something I want to share with you guys. Is something that I use for kapag unwari may mga lugar na um, walang tubig. So hindi ka makakapag wash ng mga bote. But kailangan mong linisin. Siyempre because you don't, want it, you don't want it to stay dirty. So this is what I use. Uh, these are Medela Quick Clean Wipes for breast pumps and accessories. So I don't use this all the time because I prefer um, washing with hot water and soap. But kung wala ka talagang choice at pag wala talaga akong choice, this is what I use. So kapag unwari nasa plano ako at medyo mahirap mag, uh, mag wash in the banyo because it's so small and also because I get so scared that I might drop something on the banyo floor of the plane. <laughs> so um, I just clean in my chair with this. But because we have water and we have soap and we have every chance to clean, uh, we will wash our bottles. Okay, I prefer using hot water dahil uh, feeling ko mas nakakatanggal lang siya lang. Uh, lalo na yung dibag yung gatas natin, hindi natin papansin, pero actually medyo fatty siya eh. At least that way I can get to the very end. At kung nagtatanong kayo kung whether nagsisterilize pa ako dito, hindi na. Malaki naman nga si Leon. He is uh, more than one. Oops. May tao. Kukunin na yung gatas. Okay. Yes. Here you go. How many are there? Uh, this is one, two, three, four, five, six. Six. Six bags. Okay, thank you very much. Can I put them in a go bag so they're all together? Sure, sure. And I just put this around. Okay, back to cleaning my friends. Okay. So there you have it. So the best thing for me is to pump just before you leave. Tapos, um, at least, when you put it here to dry, uh, dry na siya by the time you get back to your hotel, your hotel at kailangan mo na magpump ulit. Expect the unexpected. Pati sa amin, pinaramdam ang excitement at action sa aming adventure trip sa Wild Canyon. Oh my God! So I'm here on a, a really high bridge. Hindi ko talaga alam kung... Uh, Tatalon ako, pero parang feeling ko sayang naman kung hindi ko gagawin, di ba? Can we say three, two, oh one? Oh. Oh my God! Wow! Okay, so I just called for the milk bags, the freezer bags, um, and everything that I left in their, um, in their freezer. Dahil kailangan ko na i-impake yung mga gatas na naipon ko habang nandito ako sa Mexico. So... Let's see kung magiging effective yung way ng pag-uwi ko ng gatas. Of course, I wanna thank the moms out there, lalo na si, uh, si Feliz Lucas, who, uh, who gave me a lot of tips. <laughs> 
So uh, let's see. Let's see if I can successfully bring back my milk. Here's everything. So from the ice, um, my milk, some in here also. Um, my freezer bag, which ito yung dinadala ko inside for when I have to pump in the plane. And my packet bag, my freezable packet bag, okay? So now let's get the ice in there and the milk. So I chose this because it has a nice thick, um, it has nice thick insulation. So I'm hoping it will keep the cold in. Okay, gotta get this real turned. back my milk in good condition. Okay, alright, so um, I'm being told that I need to check in my frozen milk. Uh, that I'm not allowed to bring it on board because I don't have my baby with me. All right, so again, this is a rule in the U.S. Okay. All right. So it's not it's not Mexico, guys. Okay, it's a it's an, it's a U.S. law. All right. So this is the milk that I had. You guys saw me prepare that, and they're going to put it in that. Okay. So whatever it takes to get my milk back home to my baby. <laughs> Let's see how this works. <laughs> I'm so bothered about my milk and my bangs. Well I'm producting here for today. I'm so scared about my milk. Well if all else fails, if anything, at least I will have the milk that I will be pumping on the plane with me so i have that to bring but of course if it doesn't make it okay so i'm now here in uh, lax from mexico uh, my bag didn't go straight to pal so i had to get my bags from uh, the conveyor belt and then transfer them to another conveyor belt which will bring them to my uh, connecting flight and since i was able to get my bags i decided to uh, get my frozen goods, my frozen milk, because I'm still hoping, well, I'm gonna ask at the, at the check-in counter if, if in fact I can bring it on board as carry-on. So let's find out. Yes. I will need to get to the bottom of this, because I've spoken to a few people, and apparently, ang sabi nila, dapat pwede, kahit wala ang bata. If this doesn't work, then we know that this style is not effective. But let's hope it is. I just want to bring home my milk, guys. <laughs> Why does it have to be so difficult? Hey, I'm here waiting to be accommodated. I've already um, checked my bags in because I came from Mexico. But my dilemma is I have frozen milk. I have frozen milk here with me. Um, I, I didn't I didn't put a, I didn't put it on the conveyor belt because I know that I'm supposed to I should be allowed to have it with me as carry on. Frozen breast milk. It should be, yeah. Yeah. But the the lady in Mexico said that I I wasn't allowed. <laughs> So she had me check it in. So that's why when I got the chance a while ago, I took, I took my frozen milk. Um, so I'm hoping that this time I can bring it with me as carry on. Yeah. Okay. It's just to save other moms from the same problem. Okay. So my next question is, if I were to check this in um, with a frozen sticker, will they be setting it aside, putting it in a frozen area? Or? I can double check that for you. Okay. Yes, please. Hi. 
She's gonna find out. Oh, okay. And it's uh, it's on top of the seven kilos. Because it is like in our cabin, the bags. Yeah. Okay. Okay. So it's just gonna be along with every with everything else. There you go. So I shall take it with me, <laughs> looking like this. <laughs> Wonderful! Isn't this exciting, guys? Let's see what the status of my milk will be when we get home. It's exciting and scary. Oh my goodness. Okay, so she just got back to me saying that, um, yeah, because I don't have my baby with me, um, it might be a problem. Is it in um, separate containers? Or is it yeah, they're in separate containers. How much is it? Less, uh, less than 100 ml. <laughs> This is so full of suspense. Okay, I just want to get my milk home. Sorry, I just had to jump here to me being on the plane. Things got really hectic um, at TSA. Uh, so eventually, I ended up bringing my breast milk on with me uh, as carry-on. Um, provided that you know, I had to go through TSA and have them approve it and make sure that it was okay. So I had to go through TSA, but man, that took forever. Let me just warn you guys that are flying out from LAX. You guys need a lot of time to get through um, through TSA. At least people were kind enough to let me go ahead of them <laughs> in the line because my boarding time was 8.15 and I was still at TSA at 8.35. <laughs> um, my departure was at 9. So I was really, really stressing out. I was sprinting to the gate. Boy, was I sprinting. I felt like I was doing the CrossFit Open and that every second counted. Uh, thank God. I was able to board and I wasn't the last. But was I sweating? Still a little sweaty. But yeah. I made it guys, now it's time to get home, it's time to get the milk home to Leon and now we just have to hope that, um, that it won't melt. Okay, I'm home and I can't wait to see the kids. Hi, love! Ano, walang hi? Walang hi muna. Where's my hug and my kiss? I need a big hug. Oh, and there, there, what happened? Show me. Show me what happened. And my bum, it's out. Show me, can I see it? See? Where? See. Where? And there you have butas in your shirt. What happened here? What happened? Okay, show me, show me. Can I see? Oi. Wow, what naman? Can I kiss it better, love? Yeah. Okay, okay, okay. I'll kiss it better. I'll kiss your butt better. Okay. okay. <laughs> Wait, give me a big hug. I need a big hug. A big kiss and a big kiss. A big special kiss. A big special kiss. Mm -hmm. oh, wow. Hi, <laughs> hi, hi, hi. Hi, love. Oi. Oi. <laughs> Oi. This way! Hey love! Tata! Hi my baby love! Hi baby love! I miss this place so much! Aww. I miss you! Let's see if your milk is okay! Show me milk! What's milk? Yes! Very good! <laughs> Let's check your milk. Let's check your milk. Okay, here we go. Now let's find out anong status ng ating gatas. Is it still frozen? It's still cold. Okay, oh my goodness, oh my goodness. Okay, so it's still cold. It's a little wet. Okay, this is so cold. Okay, oh, let's see. Uh, 
Okay, guys. Let's see. It's still ice. It's still ice. Ah, it's still ice. Oh my god. It's still ice, ladies and gentlemen. We have succeeded, boys and girls. Woohoo! I'm so happy. Thank you, Lord. Thank you. Open it, Mama. Good job, guys. I'm so happy, guys. And so is my hair. I'm so happy, love. I'm so happy.